summer squash spacing and winter squash spacing for me is the same single row down a 30 inch bed uh 18 inch spacing offset from row to row so one bed 18 inches like this next bed 18 inches like that staggered right so that's that's how i've always done it it works quite well i mean with winter squash it gets pretty hairy you know by august september october but it is what it is right uh and i also i all of our squash we put down landscape fabric so what i will do with my winter squash field at the new farm is i'll get the widest fabric i can get which i believe is 10 feet and i will block out what what can i do three beds at a time giving a bit of respect to the 18 inch walkways and the fact that those walkways will sink that because they they sink because the beds are slightly raised right so my beds are a total of 48 so times three can i even get three no i'll probably i'd probably be better off going um two beds two beds at a time so I, i'll yeah no i'll actually yeah what i'll do is i'll get 10 foot fabrics they'll cover two beds plus the walkways and so for my blo entire block of winter squash what we'll do is we'll get our drip irrigation down and then we'll roll out our fabrics on two beds pre-holes we haven't put the holes in yet right um staple them down basically block out you know if i'm doing i call it i think i'm doing half a field block of squash so that's six beds uh 30 inch 18 inch walkways 50 foot long block out the entire thing in fabric go burn our holes every 18 inches offset on all those pin it down then we'll be able to use those fabrics every year uh put them back down They'll, they should just line right back up and then plant our, our winter squash right into those holes and then done no weeding or nothing in that area just just drip line just turn one one of the drip lines on and that's it so that's how we'll manage uh that whole thing <laughs>